So I'm on my way to my second trip metal detecting. I was out yesterday with my two little girls and we found two pull tabs, a giant piece of aluminum, which I think was from a spacecraft. I'm not 100% sure on that, just pretty sure. And uh, we also found a giant metal post in the ground that was like the bottom of a stop sign post, um, but buried like four feet under the ground. So um, maybe not so successful, but we had a lot of fun. But I'm going to uh, go out today and uh, see if I can find something more interesting. So I think I found my first bogey. Let's see what it is. So you can see it's in there. So it's definitely right in this area. So we're going to go take a look. And we found it. Mystery solved. Nice pull tab. Well, we'll get a ring next time. Our next item, potentially, and it sounds quite strong. So we're going to start digging. Get out here to the water. Try to rinse some of this out. I hope it's a nice pull tab this time. And what we have is a beautiful bottle cap. No gold yet, but we did find a volleyball court. And I'm thinking if people are jumping around, hitting balls, then I bet you they've dropped their change out of their pocket. And I definitely will do this for a few quarters. No luck at the volleyball court. But that's okay, we'll keep looking. It is really beautiful out now though. So on YouTube, they talk about these rocks that rings can get caught under and they look just like this. So we're going to go all the way around it, see if we can find something. Tell you, there's going to be no YouTube channel like mine. So everyone else, they go out and they find stuff. Not me. I just find rocks, I guess. I do find stuff, just not gold. And treasure chests, mermaids and things like that. But anyway, this was a good opportunity. No dice this time, but maybe next time. There. All right, we're gonna dig, see what we can find. No dice, just another pop tab. So we just found more parts of the UFO. Uh, probably should keep this on the DL. Justin Trudeau might have to come down here with the feds, figure out what this is. If any of you know what this is, message and let me know. It just looks like a hunk of spaceship to me. Another bogey, another bottle cap. Good news is I think I'd be able to start a bottle cap collection pretty soon and that is going to be next week. YouTube wonder, trust me. Well, I haven't found any mermaids. But I have found a hermit crab. Sandbar. I think this is where people with lots of 
gold coins in their pockets. I think this is where they would drop them. Something to do with fishing, I'm guessing. It's not gold, I'll tell you that. It looks like barbed wire, actually. I think it's barbed wire that's been corroded. So we'll bring that up so no one gets hurt steps on it there was another little blip or something down here but i suspect it was just another piece of that barbed wire so far this beach is just um, pop tabs and barbed wire but we're doing a great job of cleaning up the beach no more spaceship parts yet so i, I put off calling scully uh, i may still call justin But on with the search, we're gonna go over to those big rocks over there and see what we can find. So according to YouTube, a lot of things can get stuck in the rocks because they can't get pushed around by the water as easily. I found something way in there. Way in there. I don't know, it's somewhere in there. I don't know how well I can dig, but I'm gonna see what I can do. I'm gonna dig around a bit and see what I can get in my shovel and then we'll move on if we can't find anything. But. I think this is it. I think this is our gold bar after all these years, hours. the rock now there's people coming they're gonna think this is really weird so we're just gonna shut this down for a minute so all this time I thought it was digging the beach that people actually go to but I'm looking over here and there's like a restaurant and like people dogs and this guy on this thing over here looking at me like I'm digging in the wrong spot. I mean, but hey, we're having fun, right? So I think I finally found something of value. I'm just gonna get in really big deeps down here. Yeah, there it is. There it is. It's a spoon. Finally, something I could use. It's a Lagostina. That, you know, that's a quality spoon, I don't care what anyone says. Get that on Kijiji right away. Make some big dollars. Well, our trip is done. Uh, maybe not the most successful trip ever, uh, but I'm gonna show you my finds here once I get it organized. Starting with these four bottle caps. Value zero, but cleaned up the beach a bit. Six pull tabs. One spaceship part, which I think is probably the winner. I think it's aluminum. But if that didn't wow your socks, I have one Lagostina spoon. I mean, it's not every day you find a spoon on the beach. And now if I want to go get ice cream, I'm all set. Next time, gold bars.